and she has been so welcoming to the cultural gardens that uh, we are really indebted to her. To her. So here's Radhika. Thank you, Sheila, and uh, welcome to the Cleveland Cultural Gardens. Uh, we're very happy that uh, uh, this building is now the home to Cleveland Cultural Gardens. So you have access to this uh, uh, this floor as well as upstairs. Uh, there was another event upstairs, but uh, if you all have some time, we were just going to do a quick tour so you all can see that. But uh, the thinking behind this International Center is, you know, having come about 25 years ago from India, not having anything much international in this region, we felt, I always felt there was a need for something global at, you know, one-stop international center. So we've created an international business incubator for businesses to help them grow globally. Uh, we've created a warehouse where we can do foreign, uh, a foreign trade zone and distribution and attract global companies. Uh, as well as we're trying to bring the 119 ethnic communities together, uh, Cleveland Cultural Gardens being a perfect example of one such organization. Uh, we are trying to have shared space for multiple nonprofits in the international. We have the international entrepreneurs, now we have Cleveland Cultural Gardens, we have the uh, Worldwide Intercultural Network, and few other groups uh, located here. And we're trying to have shared events together. Uh, so basically, uh, the city is looking to try and create an international district here. And uh, Tracy Nichols has agreed to do that uh, based on what we're trying to do because of the access, ease of access. We have the highest number of warehousing here because the closeness, we're literally half, half a minute from every exit. 77, 71, and I think one minute of 90. So th that's why you have so many distributions. So we're trying to take a trade mission to India, China, Europe, and bring companies here. So we just landed a UK company. They bought, uh, took the space next door, 26,000. And we have a German company here, and we are looking to attract that way and help with the economic development through globalization. That's the passion and vision behind this. And down the road, as we make a little progress, you know, after we lease more, we're going to create international gift shops and uh, a restaurant, like, like a food court with a different culture. So we hope to have little immigrant entrepreneurs of every little country, and that's on the first floor. That's the plan, but step by step. So with that, thank you and welcome everyone.